The Lubicon Cree have been here since time immemorial. Indigenous peoples have a very intimate connection with our homelands here in Northern Alberta. And what we've seen instead is industry coming and essentially taking over our lands and really exploiting them and it's had a detrimental impact. We see companies digging down into the earth trying to extract the very last drop of oil. But instead, we can start looking up. We're bathing in sunlight all around us and yet we don't utilize that energy. And so that's why our community has decided to install solar We've got a state-of-the-art system going in here and I, I think it's, uh, it's really important that we take this project next level. Uh, essentially 20.8 kilowatt capacity is what this will end up becoming, uh, which will connect in through the uh, health centre but uh, feed the whole community in terms of energy. That's 80 panels are going to go on top of these poles. We're very deliberate about this because we want it to be something that's still a very much a central site in the community that people will see it, will literally welcome visitors and people will be reminded of it every day. Uh, but we wanted to make sure that we retained uh, the land use potential for it. It's something that uh, really is, is going to be in the community behind us for at least 50 years. Pretty amazing to see this project go up. A lot of the community members and the young people are working, they're getting hands-on training right now. It's really amazing to see how proud people are of it and how it's, it's a community project because all of this has been through the blood, sweat and tears of the community. Well, this project matters to us because it kind of represents who we are and where we're going in the future. When you see the work, you can, I can say that I did that took part and I did it right. So there will be a lot of people seeing it every day. I can tell people I worked on this. <laughs> I know uh, in a lot of the ceremonies and the songs, the sun is praised. You know, uh, even the project name, Pita Pan, means the coming of the dawn. And it's coming of a new era, you know, era where we use uh, you know energy that's not devastating to our environment in uh, getting this solar project going we are leaders in solar power and that's what we're teaching our youth you know they have to learn how to operate it they have to learn how to maintain it and uh, they already know how to set it up so if any any of our neighbors in the surrounding first nations or Métis settlements want to start a solar power, we can be there to help them get it going.